time to turn with Burnett going for him. Good one for Burnett because he'll get before Taylor. Now Taylor wins. Stephen Deere is coming up there. You see in the penalty area. There he is. John Kay is up there too. At the back of the penalty area. Deere stays in the goal area. What on earth was the goalkeeper doing? But what a good corner. Beautifully driven across by Dennis Burnett. A powerful drive. Stephen Deere just gets his head to it. Nobody had a chance, and nobody in this Palace defence moved an inch. Lord. Now, Lord again, Wagstaff going on the left. Another blow in the eye for the Londoner, Mark Lindsay. Right, uh, a free kick. Every Palace player between ball and goal. Wagstaff to K. Up goes Greenwood. So Greenwood, with the cut and the stitches over his eye, is still capable of getting up in the air flicking that one on and making it 2-0 for Hull City. Greenwood to Pearson. Banks is going wide of him, but Rogers has suddenly come to life. Banks gets it across well, and Greenwood did well to get it, but couldn't turn it the right angle. But what a good run by Frank Banks. He would have done well even if he hadn't had a player with him, but with Rogers so close to him, that was excellent work to get that crossover. Whittle's worked hard, he's been on his own a lot. Now Lord, with nobody looking for that one, and that was Rogers' responsibility. Lord coming again. Great shot, and got to give the credit to goalkeeper Hammond. That was a good save, but Lord working a beautiful movement there. Malcolm Lord, Swindlehurst wins. Cannon straight to Burnett and a return from Wagstaff, not quite strong enough. Cannon going forward. Dear, an easy one. Galvin with space and Lord too. Wagstaff. There goes Galvin on the right. Wagstaff still going. And now Lord. That was a good shot. Not too far wide either. But the good work done by Wagstaff and also good running by Galvin. He took a couple of defenders with him. Pearson picks it up to Wagstaff. Oh, a beautiful shot from Burnett. That deserved it. That deserved a goal. A first-time shot from a cross coming hard at him and beautifully taken, but well blocked by Hammond. One wonders whether he actually saw much of it. So it's Malcolm Lord to take the corner. Stephen Deere is up there, coming now towards the near post. Up he goes. Oh, that must be another one. The easiest goal that Ken Wagstaff has scored for a long, long time. Well, Wagstaff has got uh, 285 goals in a distinguished career, but I shouldn't think they come a lot simpler than that. A strong challenge as Malcolm Law's corner came across by Deere and Pearson, and it dropped well for Wagstaff, and away it goes.